Hi there, I'm Anna Emelia and I'm from North East Animal Rights. I'm here today on, our, on South Tyneside Beach at Little Haven, um, doing a beach clean with our other team and, uh, and talking to you about why we are doing this. So it was World Oceans Day a couple of days ago and we want to raise awareness about why it's really important to have healthy oceans. So first of all, birds and sea life depend on healthy oceans and we have some amazing um, seabirds around here and we want to make sure that they don't need, feel the need to come inland um, you know, they're, they're obviously coming in land and causing in, in this conflict between, between humans and, um, and birds. We need them to stay on the coastline and have the fish, which is, which is their food, not our food. We also need healthy seas because as humans, we depend on seas to absorb carbon dioxide, which is one of the three main greenhouse gases. Viva research says that bottom trawling fishing, which is one of the main types of commercial fishing, releases as much carbon dioxide into the atmosphere as the aviation industry. So when people are saying that we need to cut down on plane fights, yes we do, but actually this is another way of, by, of humans devastating, uh, you know, cr creating greenhouse gas emissions um, just through bottom, bottom trawl fishing. We kill three trillion sea animals every year. Now that's not just the, uh, the, the target animals like, uh, you know, like cod and haddock, uh, it's also other animals like dolphins, um, non-target fish, um, sharks as well. Sharks, you know, people think that sharks are, you know, devastating for, for humans. They, 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 we demonise them in films like Jaws. You know, hu sharks will kill possibly 10, you know, up to maybe 10 humans a year because we obviously go into their environment. But actually we kill 11,000 sharks as bycatch in, in one hour. So in a single hour, that's 11,000 sharks. So let's talk about ghost gear now. Some of you will know what ghost gear is. Others won't, but a ghost gear is actually nets and, and the, the long lines and traps and lobster pots which are left behind by the commercial fishing industry. This ghost gear will take 600 years to break down into microplastics. So it won't ever disappear, it won't just vanish, it'll just break down into microplastics. And these will end up in the food chain. We did a very short, um, we did a, sorry, we did a, um, a, a riverside clean a couple of days ago. And within a very short space of time, we were just coming across, you know, hundreds and hundreds of pieces of microplastics, less than a millimeter, um, you know, and, and, and these are pieces of plastic we just can't possibly pick up. And these are going to end up in the stomachs of animals, animals who think they're food. <clears throat> So 73% of beach litter um, is plastic. In a very, very short space of time, when we, we just walked on the beach where I'm filming now, we picked up a few pieces of plastic already. And we know that we're going to be, be chucked a block with, with, um, with bags full of plastic by the time we finish this. And in the, um, within, um, you know, every single minute as well, the equivalent of a truckload of plastic enters the ocean. So we need to be stopping, we need to be stopping um, you know, the plastics entering the, um, the, the oceans. So two ways which we can, we can help our oceans, we make, you know, get healthy and stay healthy. First of all, is to stop using single use plastics. We don't need them, use alternatives. Use plastics over and over again, if you have, you have them already, but don't go out and buy new ones. But the main, main way you can help is to stop eating fish. We don't need them. We can get all our nutrients in the same way that fish get them. We can get them from the algae, we can get them from seaweed, we can get them from um, from chia seeds, from flax seeds, all the omega um, three um, nutrients that are in them, we don't need them. We don't need to eat, we don't we don't need to eat fish to get them. You know, fish don't have them uh, naturally occurring. Um, humans don't have them naturally occurring. We get them from supplements in the way in the same way that uh, the fish do as well. So the San Amelia signing off from North Animal Rights saying, please protect our oceans. Please stop using single-use plastics and please please stop eating fish. Thank you very much. Bye for now.